Hi, my name is Nathan Liu. I'm eight years old and I'm third grade in SIS. And I am a maker. Let me tell you my maker story. When I was small, I went to a toy store with my mom to check out the new and fantastic toys. I found a toy that I really want, and when I asked my mom, Mom, can I have this toy? My mommy said, No. Sorry, Nathan, but it costs too much money. So, with a disappointed face, we went home. I went home and thought for quite a long time until I got an idea of trying to make my own toys. My mom reminded me that I've been making my own toys. I made my own Jurassic Park out of cardboard, paper, bowl, and paint. I even made my own parking lot for my toy cars that has two floors. My parents doesn't really buy us toys because they rather spend it on food, books, and traveling. Which is good. We <laughs> We visited a lot of places and tried a lot of foods. My parents liked to buy books, including STEM and origami books. During our traveling time, we saw a lot of different other toys, such as Gundam and Gacha from Japan, Can Recycle Tuk Tuk from Chiang Mai, Angkor Wat Puzzle from Cambodia, and Wooden Marble Pinball from Taiwan, and so much more. All these toys, books, and experiences inspire me to make my own toys. So why do I keep on making my own toys? Well, my parents were actually capable of buying me one. First, first, it's fun, it's funner, and let me create what I imagine it to be. For example, when I when I made my own car elevator, I I do it according on my imagination and combine it with how a real elevator actually works. The process of making the toys itself is more rewarding than buying one. Last year, I made my own Halloween costume. While I'm doing mine, my sister also starts her own recycling project on her Halloween costume. I'm so happy that she likes doing what I love to do the most. Did you realize that most of the toys that are made in the toys are mostly made out of plastic? I make my toys out of recyclable materials such as cardboard, used water bottle, straw, egg containers, and so much more, and anything reusable. My mom said that my room looks like a junkyard. But, but I think that's where my creativity begins. So now, with the support of my parents, I'm starting my own makerspace in my mom's teeny storage. Then four, I really encourage a lot of parents to let their kids have their own place to create their imagination instead of worrying about messy and dirty places that they need to clean up afterwards. Let one's imagination run wild. Thank you for listening.